Developing story, police are searching for the car that hit and killed a teen in Westwood this morning. Now to your science, Allie Kramer is live with where that investigation stands. Allie. And Ryan, here's what I can tell you. 15 year old Gabriela Rodriguez. Police say she was just simply trying to cross Harrison Avenue to get to her school bus on the opposite side of the street when she was hit by a silver Dodge journey. She was just tapped by the car's side mirror and that driver stopped to make sure she was OK. And as she was getting up off of the ground, that's when she was hit by a second car. Police telling us that it was a white Toyota Corolla coming inbound on Harrison Avenue. Now, police and school officials believe that her brother was also there there on the scene and saw her get hit the first time and she was yelling for help. School officials say that her family was able to be with her when she was rushed to Cincinnati Children's Hospital Medical Center. Gabriella's neighbors tell us that she was a fun kid and a trusted babysitter. Neighbor Chris Whaley is both devastated and angry. Hard to know that somebody can hit a child like this and keep going. What part of you is not human enough to stop and want to help the person that you just hit yeah. and you weren't in trouble before this and now i hope they hunt you down like a dog gabriella was actually as i mentioned trying to catch a metro bus to west high she is in the ninth grade Principal Dr. Carlos Blair tells us Gabriella was extremely popular. She was an excellent student and a star softball player. Principal Blair was noticeably emotional when telling us about first meeting her last year. He says she was direct and came to him wanting a better softball field. We're told that she is the reason the field got a major revamp this year, but she'll never get to play on that new field. Back out here live right now, you can see what is green spray paint across Harrison Avenue. That's the work of the investigators as they tried to recreate the scene. They were out here for several hours as Harrison Avenue was closed, trying to gather any possible clues that they have. Police are actually begging for information at this hour. They are looking for what is described as a white Toyota Corolla. They say it's an older model, possibly a 2010 with Ohio plates. They do not have that exact license plate, but they believe that that car does have front end damage. That car left somewhere this morning and came down Harrison Avenue. They know that someone knows something and they're hoping that you'll either call police or report it anonymously by calling 513-352. 30, 40. And of course, we're working to get the latest updates from Cincinnati Police on their investigation. We'll share those with you both online and with Brianna Malloy, who is continuing to cover this story on Not On Your Side this afternoon. Reporting live in Westwood, Allie Kramer, Not On Your Side.